and this is Abraham Adeyemi thank you so much for checking my youtube channel today uh, in my video today I want to uh, discuss and talk about Job's friend uh, during this time of the year I, I always read the book of Job as part of my Bible reading I read Bible every year and the book of Job has always been the last book of the Bible that I read so after many years of reading the book of Job, you know, coming to this, you know, I was thinking about uh, Job's friends and their problems. You know, I come to realize that Job's friends, they think they have perfect knowledge of how God works and how God does his things. And, and I think God proved them wrong. Uh, by letting them know that they do not have the perfect knowledge of him. I look at different things that Job's friends uh, said about God. And, you know, God had to come up and, and speak to them and say, Hey, you guys, you are not speaking truth about me as my servant Job did. So, thinking about that, and I, I bring that to our world today. You know, sometimes we think we figured everything out about God and how God should work in our lives. But let me say this to you. God said, my ways are not your ways. Neither are my thoughts are your thoughts. You see, God's way are not our way. And his ways are past finding out. All what we have to do as God's people is to trust in the perfect will of God. We may not know what God is doing with us. You know, some people have said that everything that happened in the life of Job and all the things that we read about the book of Job, you know, we have the record. But Job had no understanding of how Satan went to God and how everything transpired. He had no understanding about God. We are the one reading that one today. That is what people have said. And I believe that, you know, trusting God, even when you do not know that you believe in him. And Job, sometimes it is good to ask questions. There is nothing wrong with asking questions. Job did. But demanding an answer is foolishness. And that is why sometimes when we don't know what God is doing, we should rest. And I love the statement Job said. He said, even though he slay me, yet I will trust him. Don't be like just friends who think they had perfect knowledge of God. Submit yourself to God and be willing to trust God in every step of the way. So, I'm challenging you as we are going into the new year. Make the Bible your companion. Make your Bible your final authority. Regardless of the situation that you might be going through, you can depend and rest assured that God is in control. Till next time, God bless you.